Our number nine should have it all. Love it or loathe it looks, a sporting chassis, and as close to the perfect driving position as you can get. The Toyota Celica has what it takes to draw punters into the showroom. So why did they have to stuff it all up with inconsistent detailing and interior plastics even Hyundai would be embarrassed by? So it's disappointingly numb at the steering wheel for a car that's supposed to be sporting. The gearbox as well is a little bit ropey, not particularly accurate and a bit graunchy. There is plenty of low-down power from that turboed engine and you'll accommodate four adults in comfort, all of which means there's plenty of opportunity for this car. Under the bonnet lies a 1.8-litre engine packing variable valve timing and impressive performance is further enhanced by a relatively light body. Sit inside and the driving position is without doubt the best in our top 10 today. The steering wheels and pedals are perfectly positioned. The daring styling from outside also makes it inside, but it is let down terribly by the awful plastics used. In short, this is the best Celica for a very long time, yet it could have been so much better if the details hadn't let it down.